We continue to get you ready for the upcoming 2021 high school football season. The Brownwood Lions, the Sweetwater Mustangs, and the Snyder Tigers are looking forward to competing for a spot in the playoffs in Class 4A. Texas football says two of them are going to get it done. Here's a look. A 12-year playoff streak is on the line for the Brownwood Lions as they head into the 2021 high school football season. The Lions are short on returning starters on the offensive side of the ball. Just four positions are filled with experienced players. Jason Jackson is back at receiver, and Texas Football Magazine says he's a player to watch this season. The defense has six starters back from last year. The Lions' problem is they're in one of the toughest districts in the state with three teams ranked in the top 20. Here are the Texas football predictions for District 5, 4A, Division 1. Waco La Vega is picked to win the district championship. 2020 champion Midlothian Heritage is second. The Stephenville Yellow Jackets are third. Brownwood is expected to take the final playoff spot. Now to Class 4A, Division 2 and the Sweetwater Mustangs and Snyder Tigers. Starting at the Mustang Bowl in Sweetwater, Russell Lucas comes to Nolan County from Hamlin to lead Sweetwater at a very good time. Sweetwater is the defending district champions in District 1-4A, and quarterback Leo Holsey is back for his fourth season as a starter. He's thrown for over 6,100 yards and 75 touchdowns and run for almost 2,000 yards and 33 touchdowns. The Mustangs are picked to win the District 1-4A Division II championship for the second year in a row. Midland Greenwood is next. Monahans and Pecos are picked to take the final playoff spots. Snyder is picked out of the playoffs. The Tigers struggled in their first year with head coach Wes Wood leading the charge, but there are reasons to think things can turn around in 2021. 16 of 22 positions are filled with returning starters from last year's team. Texas Football Magazine says the defense will need to lead the way while the offense gets things headed in the right way. Tomorrow night, we're going to take a look at what Texas football has to say is going to happen in Class 3A in the big country. Quick at the NFL.